So we continue Beast Castle. So now that we're behind these statues... I'M ALIVE! Yeah. So you can release them, and that releases... Shut up, Donald! Them. Magic does not work against them, so Donald was completely useless there. These statues have a reaction command, I believe. Yeah, I just showed it off. It, that's what I said. That that's it, you release the possessor that's in them. Art puzzle piece that was just sitting there. Yeah. On your second visit here, this level becomes probably one of the hardest levels in the game. Yeah, you can get fucked up really easily. I, I, I on my second visit, I died a lot. Yeah. They're just the fucking enemies. Mm-hmm. They're very strong. Good place to grind, though, on your second visit. Yeah, really good place to grind. Because once you learn the patterns, you can dodge them pretty easily, and, you know, you can do all that. Right now, it's pretty easy, honestly. Even the boss isn't too hard. Hey, it's that guy. He had the lance. I wonder if he's going to be a boss. You know. Feed your anger. A really fucking annoying boss. Well, isn't it more annoying in the data fight? See, if you don't want a 40 minute fucking part of me just fighting him in the data fight, shut your fucking mouth. Shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> I fucking hate this guy. <laughs> See, he has accomplices. You know what made Fox sound so great was that there's like six or so people to work with, so you weren't busy like making like a whole bunch of characters that are like kind of one note. And the thing uh, is, is the organization members in here aren't one note, and all of them except for Marluxia more more note in chain of memories that's why it is good that we did have chain of memory because because it did allow us to get to know the personalities of the other ones too without having to have 13 in this game help beast come to his senses so he used the reaction command wake up and then knock his fucking ass out if only he had stun grenades well that's what i'm doing see uh, stun, stun grenade would have uh knocked him out in an instant And then you need to get near him with Cogsworth, and then you just mass triangle and charge him up. And that frees him from the darkness. So, this is the only time we'll ever see Cogsworth beam. Oh, did I explain that to you, uh, Sean? About the gift bonuses? Cogsworth. <laughs> Not with the gift, what? At the end of a boss fight, usually, you'll... Or, like, certain events and stuff, you'll... Instead of leveling up, you'll get a git bonus. Which is why you can do level one runs in this because you get second chance from a get bonus. I did what? And the get bonuses basically give you HP, give you certain abilities, that type of stuff. Zaldan. So now we can say his name. It's Zaldan. He came from the darkness. He's a dick. He used my anger to control me. He's a real dick. He's a cum stain. And turned it all into rage. There was nothing I could do. I could no longer see the truth. So by next weekend, I should have all parts of this up uploaded, by the way. You wanted to make sure that you didn't hurt him, right? Was that it? Was it, was it to protect them? Sure. We know you're good inside. He's right, you buff Master. motherfucker. We've all seen how kind you can be. After all, Bell can see the goodness in your heart, but I'm afraid you've yet to. Bell. Well, one thing about Beast and Bell is I, I honestly feel like they do love each other, you know? And I think it's rare to, you know, honestly feel that within Disney movies, in my opinion. She's too good. 
Well, most of the time, they don't really focus on the relationship. They won't focus on the development of a character. Yeah. But this movie was all about the development of the relationship because that impacted both their characters. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, we got Beast in our party. It's good to have you back, man. You still wreck shit, right? Oh, yes, he does. Yes, he does, good sir. So, I'm going to explain the synthesis real quick. While we have nothing else to talk about. To complete the synthesis within the journal, you need to get... You need to do everything for synthesis. You need to make everything. You need to collect 30 of every shard. Well, every shard except for the bonus stuff, if I remember correctly. You, you need to collect... shards everywhere. You need to collect 25 of the stones yeah i completed that puzzle i got an ap boost thank you for playing <laughs> um and you need to collect 20 of every gem at once if you use a gem while it's stored in the synthesis it takes it away so that means you can get like 400 gems but if you keep using them it won't give you the collection part of it that's why synthesis grinding sucks in this game. And that's why you play on critical for that extra, for those two extra lucky luckies. I would have liked it if you could get an instant game over by breaking the beast's rose uh, container. <laughs> Sar, what the fuck are you doing? I'm breaking his rose! Fuck him! <laughs> Fucking dick! I'm just trying to run. And that's why sliding dash is really good, because you just charge fucking forward towards them. But basically, you don't want to make anything unless it's a luck ring before if you're planning on completing the journal. Because then you can get all that shit done very quickly. You also need to obtain one of every material, which means you have to fight one of the data fights. Oh, no, no, no. You actually don't. Never mind. You'll just be walking around the corner and the statue will decide, hey, I'm going to come to life. Yeah. Sometimes it does and sometimes it doesn't. It's, uh, RNG. It's annoying. <laughs> So my strength increased, level 14. Kill everything. Yep. If you if you clear out a room, honestly, on any difficulty, you should be fine. You shouldn't have to grind. Except when it comes to the second visit for this bitch. I don't see why you wouldn't. Alright, these are Lancers. Hold on. I believe they're Lancers. Hey, it's Lance our buddies. Lance Soldiers. They're Lance Soldiers. It's our buddies, the fat assholes. Yep. I think, they, I think they time. actually fight exactly the same from the first game. <laughs> Not even kidding. I think they have the same pattern. Yeah, they do. Except for when they start uh, getting pissy at you and glow purple. Like, these enemies, shadows, and like one other enemy are exactly the fucking same. Thank god I have enough strength to kill them though, because they can fuck you up. Yeah. When they when they get into their little rage mode, they start doing that. They start sliding around, attack. and you can block it and attack back with the reaction command. The problem is is if you miss that block command they just like tear into you by the way i came here i came here way too soon yeah you're not supposed to be here yet uh, the... no i'm in there and you're up. just sitting in there what are you doing shut up leave me alone i don't want to talk about it in three five eight over two days you actually go to the top of the ball uh the ballroom you see search up there mm -hmm. so we're gonna ignore grim did that because there was no point in going in there no, I wanted to show it off. 
Oh, you you wanted to appreciate the architect. Yeah, especially since he sat in there like... <laughs> Listen, don't, don't speak to me like that, Zio. You don't know me. We, 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 Grim had good RNG there, none of the statues decided to be like, Hey, I'm gonna turn it to a ass a monster. Yeah. Yeah, you have to talk to this bitch first. Yes, I'm gonna call her a bitch, cause she's a fucking bitch. She is. No one, no, nobody's, nobody's disagreeing with you. Hey, wait a minute. Do you know what she's gone through? She's a, uh, yeah, she's a bitch. <laughs> Where's Bell? And he's very upset by this news, by the way. God damn it, independent women! Like, seriously, there's a time and a place for this bullshit! So yeah, you can just pretty much ignore everything. I was gonna skip that. <laughs> Bell, where are you? She's in the ballroom, guys. Now we go there. <laughs> Make sure you're all ready. And getting rid of the new icons because you <laughs> that shit <laughs> they that shit hits. bother me. It bothers the <laughs> it's your team. It's just fucking noise the shit out of me when every time I see that new command up there, I'm just like, fuck off! It's not new, I've played this game like eight times! I'd be kinda messed up if after you saw the new thing, it would, it would afterwards just say old. <laughs> oh my god. Oh fuck. I've heard, of, I've heard of a ball and chains, but this is ridiculous. Oh no, the floor's turned to darkness. And this now is the entire Shadow's room. Talk. Now we'll never have shadows. All right. Ain't this a good boss room? It actually is. This is what they used for the demo at Best Buy when it was released. This is my first interaction with it. With Kingdom Hearts 2 in general, you so probably I, thought it was you probably thought it was an original setting too, and yeah, uh, no, wasn't just, I knew this was Beast. What tipped you off? Fucking Beast. What makes you think this wasn't Hollow Bastion 2.0? Because I kind of figured it wasn't. I just went, oh, Beast. So once again, he's like the possessor. He goes and possesses shit. It uses the room creatively. That's what I like about it. And it uses the Heartless's ability creatively, too. It doesn't mean it isn't annoying, though. Because the fucker always does this! Let's just go back and heal real quick. I just want to have fun. Can you stop? Oh god! <laughs> He's still. S well, no, actually, that looks like a pained expression. <laughs> he can't stop smiling. So he, even when he's hurt, he's uh, he's uh, still smiling. Well, oh shit. Okay, that hurts. I'm gonna die now. <laughs> Ouchie. Just get it, get in time. 
Alright, that, yeah, it is actually. That is Dark Thorn. Uh, interesting trivia. When I, when I did my actual first play, no, 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 it was, uh, my second playthrough, I think. Alright, it, no, it was my playthrough on Critical. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Uh, I actually turned into Anti-Form and killed him. A pat on the back. I'm gonna start yelling. See if that. No, I tried the to boss. step vault. That would actually like do a lot of damage to him, but because I was underneath the thing, I couldn't complete the reaction thing. God damn it! I'm already dead. I almost did again. You know, well, there's another reaction. It never made sense to me how they can like hit the boss when they can't even see it. Well, uh, I mean, you, sway, you sway your shit in the wind. God damn it! If Donna. you go into a drive form, it instantly fills your MP and your HP. Oh shit! Oh shit! Ow! 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 Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Annihilation. Uh, if I had turned into uh, anti form there, that would have been fucking sweet. That would have been cool to show to, to to become a beast like beast to the beat to the defeat. Yeah, I did that. With dude. Beast. Did you know that anti form all of its attacks are usually considered combo finishers? Yeah, but I'm just saying it would have been cool to beat uh, to beat the beast like heartless by becoming a beast like form by helping yeah. beast. I agree with that. It was fucking awesome. I wish I could do it again. It would anyway. be beast. Problem is, is I didn't grind as much as I. We beat Ganon. <laughs> hey, it's Zaldin. Zaldin. Rar. Organization Thirteen. What does he want here? He must be with Organization Thirteen. Uh. Ever heard of the Nobodies? When a strong-hearted person turns into a heartless, a Nobody is created too. See, the organization has got to control all the nobodies. That's right. And they were going to make you into a heartless. That way they could get that nobody of yours and have control over it. You're all right. You so. did fuck all. No. She did everything. She ran outside the room in order to not get hurt, and the boss battle happened. Yep. I don't know. I like. I, I think they're the best Disney couple. I I haven't done anything Fuck Frozen. What, dude? Frozen was a shit fucking romance. Who the fuck says it was good? I know you weren't yourself. You don't have to apologize. I don't know. But, <laughs> but I had hoped. Uh, fucking Tangle had a great romance. I wish yeah. You could start trusting me. Running short. What do you mean? Remember the role? No. <laughs> you know, by Game Hearts 3, I would like if they actually finished off uh, the story of this game. Yeah. Or this movie, I should say. Well, in the credits, we see he turns back into a human, so. And he turns, he's a beast again in Kingdom Hearts 3. Listen, I cheated on her once, okay? Didn't expect this to happen. <laughs> the rose is reformed and it became right and, and it is and, and he has to do the whole thing all over again. Yeah. By means of bullshit. <laughs> oh god. What if he had what if the rose had disappeared after he had used this? God damn it, sorry, what the fuck? <laughs> I had that, no wouldn't the next that, wouldn't that wouldn't that be awkward? I'm sorry, Beast. I had to open up the next pad place. I'm sorry. No, what happens is is that the rose just gets more, its petals back, so there's more time. Oh, God. <laughs> well, he is. We'll come back. If you haven't done it by now, I, I think at this point I'm just going to give up with you, man. Have to go? Yeah. 
Our planet needs us. We gonna make sure they fuck. Do you think they fucked, Sean? Or the king, the heartless, the organization, uh, Bell and Beast? Yeah, as Beast. Mm. Yeah, maybe once or twice. <laughs> he probably has the ability to transform back and forth. Do, do you think she likes when he puts on the, you know, the Beast armor? Well, let me let me just say something, Grim. Even though Gast every last instance of Gaston is covered in hair, Beast still hasn't beat. 